Well, it's Saturday morning at Cage Cove. Actually, it's 12.41. Kind of an unusual time for me to be riding. I had to come test this thing out. I know. problem at, at speed. I had it up to 25. We're, we're going about 20 right now. And the front folds down. It comes down further, so I have to kind of wash my speed a little bit. Around about 16 now, and I'm really breaking. Saturdays, when it's not a bicycle time, is the traffic. These more stopped. We've got people getting out, checking out the horses up there. That's okay. Way over there, we got one, two, three, four turkeys. That I see five turkeys. feel a tremendous amount of difference in the, the coolness underneath here as far as the sun beating down my arm is just is really hot this is cool it's a pretty much a stock rig that I bought off the internet for about 50 bucks now show you the little wooden piece I put back in the back. Other than that, it's pretty much completely stock. Yeah, but now you're on YouTube. cars to get behind we have <coughs> hay wagons. Are getting around some of these curves. Well, that thing, anyway. I think he likes cyclists and orange shirts, so you're good to go today. Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Leaves an awful taste in his okay. mouth. The bear on the ground. You can see everybody pointing over here. Oh yeah, you can see where they've been in the trees. You see all this debris up here. Well, you just, you're way too comfortable in that. I know. What do you do? Eat the tree dry up here? Sure. Oh man. Yes. Where'd the mother be? She's up in the woods there. Nobody 
cub right there. It's hard to find uh, hard to find Saturdays that are dry and pretty, and you can see we're we're just coming up on halfway around, and you can see the traffic down through there. I don't know if I can stall long enough to make it down this hill. I really, really doubt it. Uh, it's a pretty day, whether I get to bomb the hill or not. around the frame there. Coming up to a couple of hooks, it just hook right into this line. Well, that guy's giving me some room back here. I appreciate it. It's my favorite here. Let's go up to a little higher gear here. I'm really breaking and I don't want to. Maybe I'll cut it loose after this. I don't see that red car up there. Well, let's turn her loose here and see what happens. You see it's starting to come way down. Way down. In fact, I'm holding the top up. Yeah, that could get pretty, uh, pretty nasty. Right about 20, about 22, the top uh, just collapses. What happens is this this part right here comes down, and uh, get back about where my my face is. That overhead be a great place for a GPS or uh, route directions. A lot of a lot of flat storage up there. Well, it's not all that safe in the wind. But this is pretty much pretty much a touring canopy. Uh, as you can see it uh, Tasty. That's letting letting through the light, so it's not dark under here. But uh, quite comfortable. Uh, the rods up overhead are two pieces. I don't know really the total length on. There's a joint uh, right up in the middle of the, the canopy. There's a joint sleeve where they slip together. 
but I, like I said, it's pretty much stock. I did paint these little ends right here black. They just look, they just look kind of gnarly when they were yellow. What do you think? Racing stripe? Maybe. You're on camera. <laughs> There's not going to be anything left of that tree. <laughs> little tutorial here on this canopy. On the back, this is one piece of wood that's been split and then uh, carved out to fit over the luggage rack. A couple of bolts holding it together. Big old fat fender washers. Just a fiberglass rod, quarter inch rod. up on the front it's basically a bungee that's velcro strapped in with a couple of hooks on the end and pretty simple little tensioning pieces here I don't know if I can do it one-handed not very well Anyway, that puts your tension on to keep it level. I can let it go. And you can see it's slipping. I found out if this is too low in the front, uh, I can see under it. But as I get up to speed, it dips even lower, and I almost have to look out the sides. Pretty much it. Pretty simple. 